Welcome to AI Latest Industry Trends. In a groundbreaking development, researchers are harnessing the power of artificial intelligence to integrate emotional intelligence into music learning environments. This innovative approach aims to revolutionize the way students interact with and understand music by creating AI systems that can recognize, interpret, and respond to the emotional nuances within musical compositions. The core of this research lies in developing algorithms that enable AI to analyze various components of music, such as melody, rhythm, and harmony, and understand the emotions they convey. By doing so, these AI systems can provide real-time feedback to learners, adapting the teaching methodology to suit the emotional context of the piece being studied. This not only enhances the learning experience but also fosters a deeper connection between the student and the music. Moreover, this integration of emotional intelligence into AI-driven music education tools opens up new possibilities for personalized learning. Each student's emotional response to music is unique, and by recognizing these individual reactions, AI can tailor the educational content to fit personal preferences and learning styles. This customization ensures a more engaging and effective learning process, catering to the emotional and educational needs of each learner. Researchers are exploring various applications of this technology, from interactive music learning apps to AI-assisted music therapy sessions, demonstrating the versatile potential of emotional AI in the field of music education. As this research progresses, it is set to redefine the boundaries of music learning, making it more accessible, intuitive, and emotionally resonant for students around the world. All right, let's begin, innovate today, your primary destination for the newest developments in tech and artificial intelligence, dated February 6, 2024. Let's dive in. Perplexity, a new AI-powered search engine, promises more relevant and high-quality results than traditional search engines. Moog releases Animoog Galaxy, a multidimensional synthesizer for Apple Vision Pro. Acer Travelmate P-Series laptops feature AI-assisted productivity features. The impact of AI on various industries, including finance, retail, and transportation, is a recurring theme. Researchers explored developing emotional intelligence in music learning environments using AI. Meta announced support for iPhone 15 Pro spatial videos on Quest headsets. U.S. judge allowed millions of Apple users to pursue an App Store lawsuit. Google may rebrand its AI chatbot Bard to Gemini and offer an advanced paid version. Acer released a new Travelmate P-Series laptop with AI-assisted productivity features. Art, India Art Fair showcases AI-powered installations and collaborations. Content creation AI tools like ChatGPT, Descript, and Notion are changing how creators work. Finance AMD is growing its AI presence, creating opportunities for investors. Marketing, AI and social media can be used for brand awareness and outreach, both ethically and unethically. Samsung's Galaxy S24 boasts impressive AI-powered photo editing features. Healthcare, AI can help predict molecular glues, AION labs, but raises concerns about data privacy, environmental watchdog. Finance, Quasar Markets launches an AI-powered financial research platform. Education, a study challenges fears of AI replacing jobs, suggesting gradual integration. Retail, Amazon introduces AI shopping assistant Rufus. Research suggests mixed reactions to AI in shopping. Religious leaders in Asia to sign a call for ethical AI development. A study shows AI in war games tends towards violence, raising ethical concerns. A new U.S. congressional task force could regulate AI, but it's not focused on the 2024 election. Analysts are recommending AI stocks, with one even suggesting a stock that could yield an 11% monthly dividend. Wedbush analyst Dan Ives is excited about Tim Cook's AI efforts at Apple. Generative AI is expected to impact jobs in the entertainment industry. AI is transforming healthcare, with benefits for both practitioners and patients. Chinese selfie app giant Meitu saw its profits triple in 2023 thanks to new generative AI-powered tools. 
Country singer Lainey Wilson testified before Congress about the dangers of AI misuse in the music industry. Explicit fake images of Taylor Swift highlight how laws haven't kept pace with AI technology. AI's growing energy demands are raising concerns about its environmental impact. Hugging Face has launched an open-source AI assistant maker to rival OpenAI's custom GPTs, Apple is reportedly preparing to buy an AI startup to anonymize private data in images. Artichaus is hosting an exhibit celebrating the intersection of AI and human creativity. AI's impact is growing, from banking and finance to art and literature, AI is transforming various industries. AI job market While concerns exist about job displacement, some experts believe AI integration could elevate salaries and job value. AI regulations There's ongoing debate and action around regulating AI, with figures like Elon Musk advocating for it. Generative AI advancements, Google Maps, stock images, and creative industries are seeing advancements with generative AI. China, AI adoption in banking, censorship concerns, and a new AI unicorn company. Japan, award-winning author used AI in writing, I designed pastries, and Korean tech startups influencing the market. Nvidia's stock hits record high, chipmaker market value sees significant growth, and deepfakes used in scams. Nvidia's tailored for China H20 AI chip becoming available for pre-order. OpenAI CEO Sam Altman raising billions to build a network of AI chip factories. AI is being used in various fields, including cancer treatment, education, and finance. EU approves Landmark AI Act, setting global standards for ethical development and regulation. Google Q4 earnings exceed expectations, highlighting AI's growing importance. Concerns rise over AI-generated child abuse content, with thousands of reports in the US. SK Hynix plans mass production of next-gen HBM4 memory by 2026, boosting AI capabilities. Australia launches Smart Rainforest, project using AI and data management technology. AI is transforming everyday life, but regulations are still being debated. Thousands of AI-generated deepfakes are being used for malicious purposes. Google reassures people that AI won't replace jobs, but will enhance them. A new language model for the Malayalam language, Malaya LLM, has been introduced. Apple is now taking reservations for demos of its Apple Vision Pro device. AI is driving significant growth in the cloud infrastructure market, with quarterly revenue reaching $74 billion globally. Google will no longer be caching web pages, effectively ending its backup of the internet. Avenged Sevenfold will be releasing a virtual reality concert on both Apple and Meta VR devices. Meta, Facebook, stock surged by 20.3%, adding $196 billion in market value in a single day. Researchers used a supercomputer to determine whether molecules of life can form naturally under the right conditions. Tesla is recalling nearly all of its US vehicles due to a font size issue with certain visual warning lights. The European Union unanimously endorsed its landmark AI legislation, known as the EU AI Act. Apple Watch Series 9 and Ultra 2 drop blood oxygen feature amid patent dispute. Researchers propose Mambatab, a new machine learning method for handling tabular data. Proteogenomics reveals new target for beating drug resistance in acute myeloid leukemia. Survey on entrepreneur use of AI for branding, customer discovery, etc. Forget the new MacBook Pro, Apple had something better planned according to Forbes. TikTok to lose Taylor Swift music due to licensing disagreement with Universal Music Group. Facebook Zetobox, social gaming meets rewards with a sweepstakes model. Generative AI already impacting legal research and writing, but accuracy concerns remain. Perplexity AI is a tool for answering questions quickly and precisely. Expectations for Google Pixel Watch 2 and updates to Acer and Apple devices. Updates on various AI tools and libraries, including Midjourney V6, Torque Multimodal, and TSDAE. 
research on mapping neural networks in mouse brains, protein language models, and expanding coverage of spatial proteomics. FTX seeks court approval to sell its shares in AI company Anthropic. India leads the way in app downloads, with Indian startups competing in autonomous driving development. LIV Golf partners with Google Cloud to offer any shot, any time live broadcast feature. A Chinese scholar has unveiled what he's calling the world's first AI-powered simulated child. Apple Vision Pro reviews highlight its mixed reality capabilities and digital crown input. Tesla shareholders to vote on Elon Musk's proposed $55.8 billion pay package. New Intel drivers released for Core i9-11900KF CPU graphics, wireless Bluetooth, and Smart IC. Building large-scale AI tools, questions about how SEO and other AI-powered web tools are built. Google Doodle for Sri Lanka celebrates Sri Lanka's Independence Day. AI voice chatbot, user seeks guidance on building a multilingual voice chatbot. Neolithic's AI produce inspection, launch of an automated system for inspecting fruits and vegetables. AI robots with LLMs integrating large language models with robotic architecture. 2024 AI trends, exploration of key trends in healthcare, customer service, sustainability, and ethics. Meta Q4 earnings, record revenue and nearly 4 billion monthly users across Facebook and other apps. Naver's Generative AI Push plans to leverage Generative AI to expand globally. Samsung Galaxy S23 Comparison, Specs Comparison of the Base, Plus, and Ultra Models. Python Libraries, Return for Training Neural Networks, CatalystCoop.Puddle for Data Archiving. Facebook sees AI as a key part of its future, particularly for content moderation. Generative AI can be used to create content, but it raises ethical concerns. Rohingya refugees have filed a petition against Facebook in India. Older NVIDIA GPUs see performance improvements with a mod that converts DLSS 3 to FSR 3. Korean tech startups are fueling digital transformation in Japan. Meta has released a new version control system called Sapling. An NIT Kelly Cut professor has been booked for posting a comment on Facebook praising Nathram Gadza, who assassinated Mahatma Gandhi. Google has released a new course on cybersecurity risk management. YouTube Music and Premium have reached 100 million subscribers. Researchers are looking for benchmark data augmentation techniques for vision transformers, VIT. A study found that large language models struggle to learn long-tail knowledge. A user is facing challenges with generating faces using a variational autoencoder. Lightning AI slash PyTorch Lightning, a framework for pre-training, fine-tuning, and deploying AI models. Tesla is recalling over 2 million vehicles due to small warning lights. Apple Vision Pro, a new headset, may change how people consume content and work on computers. It has a high price of $3,500. Microsoft CEO expressed concerns about explicit AI-generated deepfakes. Researchers are looking for connections between uncertainty quantification and AI alignment. A new AI model called Laser, developed by Microsoft, can improve the reasoning capabilities of large language models. Researchers at OpenAI initially withheld the release of their GPT-2 model due to concerns about potential misuse. AI is being integrated into a variety of applications, including telemonitoring for respiratory allergies, plant disease detection, and the development of AI-generated pastries in Japan. Qualcomm has released a new processor that will bring advanced AI capabilities to more affordable smartphones. AI is playing a key role in the growth of subscription revenues for companies like YouTube and Google Cloud. A recent study found that users on Elon Musk's Twitter are less interested in fact-checking accounts and more engaged with extreme media outlets. Catholic World Report is calling for collective activism to address the negative consequences of social media use among tweens and teens. The game Spookville, Cabin Escape is being updated with new AI behaviors and an open-world environment.
An artist has discovered a method to create unique images using Midjourney by prompting it to create hallucinations. Several videos about Facebook marketing have been released, including Best Headline That Converts Quickly and Lift Off 2024. The State of Influencer Marketing Benchmark Report 2024 has been released, highlighting a shift towards short video content. Nicole Kidman's new Amazon TV series, Expats, filmed in Hong Kong, is unavailable to stream in Hong Kong. Mark Zuckerberg's net worth has surpassed Bill Gates as Meta's stock has surged. OpenAI has announced that users can now bring GPTs into any conversation in ChatGPT. A new version of the Star Whale AI model development platform has been released. Geely, a Chinese automotive giant, launched 11 satellites into orbit to create a network for autonomous vehicles. Google has removed the cached website results feature from its search engine. Artists are sabotaging AI image generators by feeding them misleading data. AI is being used to improve web browsing features, such as summarization and search. Multiple users are reporting issues with Google Pixel phones, including charging problems and software glitches. Microsoft is working on a feature to migrate pipelines from ADF or Azure Synapse to Microsoft Fabric. China has launched the world's first in-orbit AI commercial hypersatellite. Stocks are climbing to new highs despite mixed earnings reports from big tech companies. Science Unscripted is asking for feedback on whether they should use AI imagery for their shows. A user on r slash learn programming is asking for advice on where to start learning programming. Psychology classes are rethinking how they teach executive MBAs due to the impact of AI. A new technique called CRAG, Corrective Retrieval Augmented Generation, enhances the accuracy of large language models. Swarms 4.0.3 a Python library for managing tasks and workflows, has been released. Researchers are exploring federated learning for satellite communication. Apple is making changes to comply with the EU's Digital Markets Act. Grambling State defeated Jackson State in a close HBCU basketball game. UT is building one of the largest AI computer clusters in the world. The 8th Bytosa Global Conclave was held in New Delhi, focusing on innovation and AI. A sales professional expresses concern about AI automation potentially taking jobs. Google has begun testing phasing out third-party cookies on Chrome, affecting about 1% of users. Apple has a software update to adjust radio frequency output of the iPhone 12 over health concerns. Eagle 7B, a 7.52B parameter AI model built on the RWKV V5 architecture and trained on 1.1T tokens, outperforms Transformers. Google Search Central live events are being held in Brazil and Argentina in 2024. Researchers are exploring how to prevent AI chatbots from being tricked into misbehaving. Locust distributed load testing is available on Google Kubernetes engine. Leaks suggest the Samsung Galaxy S23 FE will have bright new colors. Amazon KCVG Air Hub workers are voting to ratify their union constitution. A professor at NIT Calicut was booked for a Facebook post supporting Gandhi's assassin. Parents are using ChatGPT to create unique bedtime stories for their children. Shared Google Maps lists are becoming a popular way to share travel recommendations. AI adoption in businesses is increasing, driven by data center demand and potential to aid various business models. New backend.ai Python packages released for managing AI applications. PyPI updates include libraries for material structure search, model optimization, and more. ChatGPT course designed for designers covers basics, prompts, and limitations. Law enforcement braces for surge of AI-generated child abuse imagery. Microsoft Surface Duo foldable phone with dual screens receives hands-on review. Stories by Angris tool lets you create choose-your-own-adventure stories with AI. ChatGPT users share how you use ChatGPT Plus, API, or other solutions on your MacBook Pro. Apple users frustrated with the lack of a shortcut to move notes to folders in Apple Notes. 
iPhone users, Apple explains the risks of allowing third-party app stores. Linux Mint users share their positive experiences using Linux Mint as their daily driver. Machine learning jobs explore high-paying roles beyond AI, including AI officer and data scientist. Alternatives to Google AdSense, consider Ezoic or SheMedia if you were rejected from Monumetric due to traffic location. Enjoy cute AI-generated corgi images or try an AI-generated yoga routine. Discover resources for understanding essential machine learning algorithms, demystifying neural networks, and exploring AI versus ML versus DL, experiment with different recurrent neural networks and long short TRM memory architectures. Read about convolutional neural networks and roast your first Django project. Learn how to create stunning AI images and craft an ideal snowflake multi-cluster warehouse. Explore Stories by Angris, a free AI tool for creating choose-your-own-adventure stories. Measuring performance in supervised learning models is a key task for AI product managers. New Python tutorials cover feed-forward neural networks and real-time data processing and prediction. A new Rust library, Leanfa, can be used for machine learning tasks, such as linear regression. New Python libraries, Python CDD and Llama Index Readers AstroDB, have been released. Space Datasets is a new Python library for storing and managing multimodal data. Universal Music has pulled its music from TikTok due to a contract dispute. A Stack Overflow question asks about efficient sum of distributions and sampling. The Spectator argues that the world would be a better place without Facebook. A new Python tutorial covers experimenting with different hyperparameters for feed-forward neural networks. Smartphones have evolved from communication devices to digital Swiss Army knives. Updates have been released for Intel's extension for TensorFlow and the Llama Index Reader's Chat plugin. Yuffie has released a three-pack of Yuffie Cam 3 security cameras with AI-powered face recognition. A Plymouth man has been working on visual effects for Apple, Disney, and Warner Brothers Samsung has unveiled two new Galaxy phones with 128GB storage and 50MP cameras. The Tech Advocate has released a roundup of the best tech winners of CES 2024. Italy's Data Protection Authority has flagged OpenAI's ChatGPT for violating data protection rules. Kohl's is leveraging Palantir's analytics suite to enhance retail operations with AI. A teacher is using innovative techniques to increase engagement in her virtual classroom. A Redditor is asking for a free AI program to convert music audio from one genre to another. Another Redditor is generating Green Day song lyrics using Stable Diffusion and Comfy UI. The Straits Times reports that generative AI will have its biggest impact in banking and tech. Analysts expect a strong earnings report from Audio Codes a company specializing in conversational AI. A user on Microsoft Fabric Community asks about PowerShell modules for Microsoft Fabric Admin Center. Apple considers the iPhone 15 Pro running warmer than previous models to be expected behavior and is exploring graphene solutions for the iPhone 16 Pro. Apple reported disappointing results in December, encountering hurdles in the wake of the iPhone 15 launch. Reliance Industries, led by Mukesh Ambani, may acquire a majority stake in the merger of Geo Cinema and Disney Hotstar, potentially impacting Netflix and Amazon. A new research paper explores strategies for converting Schenner variables to PyTorch tensors. Researchers from MDPI Publishing explore UAV acoustic detection and rice leaf disease detection using AI. Adam and Freud shares a guide on summarizing YouTube videos with AI in 2024. China and Russia are reportedly using AI to shape public sentiment in Ukraine and Taiwan through disinformation campaigns. Surat police in India are utilizing a chatbot and advanced analytics to reduce cybercrime. A clerk in Hong Kong was tricked into transferring 200 million Hong Kong dollars to fraudsters who used deepfakes to impersonate colleagues in a video conference. Japanese pastry chefs are using AI to create flavors that mimic the stages of love. Several new research papers explore fine-tuning strategies and applications of Tsalis distribution in machine learning.
A new method for accurate and efficient low-bit post-training quantization of convolutional neural networks is proposed. Research explores using AI language models for rapid intraoperative queries in plastic surgery. A new attention-based monocular depth estimation method is proposed for remote sensing images. Leap AI offers a no-code platform for easily creating AI-automated workflows. India ranks first in AI skills penetration and fifth in AI startup investments, according to Stanford's AI Index report. Skill demand shifts in the tech sector are impacting workforce strategies of tech giants. Google Maps' new navigation interface is now available for more Android Auto users. Samsung and Cisco have partnered to create a 5K teleconferencing display. Video content, AI integration, chatbots, wishlist marketing, and mobile optimization are key digital marketing trends for e-commerce in 2024. Explore the strategic brilliance behind Facebook ads to elevate your marketing game. New research explores the Euler Mascheroni constant in machine learning. A new diffractive deep neural network, D2NN, based classifier for holographic memory is proposed. Jeff Bezos plans to sell 50 million Amazon shares by January 2025. Figure AI, a startup developing humanoid robots, is in funding talks with Microsoft and OpenAI. Tom's Guide asked ChatGPT, Claude, and Bard to predict the Super Bowl winner. Analytics Insight explores data analytics versus data science as a career. Apple's Mixed Reality Headset Vision Pro gets torn down, revealing complex design. Tiny Llama Research shows smaller AI models can outperform larger ones. Meta will allow EU users to unlink Facebook, Instagram, and Messenger info. Author wins Japanese Literary Award using AI in novel, sparking debate. Deepfake video call scam tricks global firm out of $26 million. Research explores using Jensen polynomials in machine learning. New method proposed to fuse knowledge from multiple large language models. AI integration could elevate salaries and job value, according to CEO. Universities advise against using ChatGPT for college applications. Samsung is removing Google Assistant from all its smart TVs starting March 1, 2024. Qualcomm may introduce a new chipset in 2024 focusing on AI and 5G. Google signed a major deal for offshore wind power to power its European data centers. OpenAI study finds AI could be used to create biological threats. Google Drive API experiencing 403 forbidden errors with Fast API. Facebook has 2.11 billion daily users, marking a 6% increase year over year. Google's local service ads can help roofing contractors generate leads. Meta is spending heavily to develop AI that surpasses Google and Microsoft's. A study explores using AI to optimize the quality and shelf life of Borthecora juice. Delhi CM Kedrival served notices over MLA poaching allegations. Amazon Fire Stick owners discover a trick to control their TVs with the remote. Circle to Search will remain exclusive to Google and Samsung devices for most of 2024. Users fixed the Android Auto Coolwalk bug by changing animation settings. Facebook doesn't have a built-in feature to see who views your profile. Analysts have mixed opinions on Apple's stock price, with some raising and others lowering targets. Facebook is celebrating its 20th anniversary and remains the most popular social network despite facing scrutiny. Amazon has released new Blink outdoor cameras with better battery life and range. PC World is offering a $30 e-degree to help people master ChatGPT. Apple's M2 and M3 chip support Float 16, a format that can improve the performance of AI applications. The Tesla share price has fallen by around 25% since the start of the year. A new paper compares four deep learning models for predicting age from electrocardiograms. A new study proposes a method for precision leak detection in supermarket refrigeration systems using AI. Geeky Gadgets has published a video comparing ChatGPT and Google Bard.
AI will be a major focus of the BioIT World Conference and Expo in Boston in April. Some users are reporting that the Samsung Galaxy S24 is breaking Android Auto. Google has extended Project IDX with new features, including an integrated iOS simulator and Android emulator. Apple was the big winner in the smartphone market in 2023, accounting for 50% of global sales revenue. A finance worker was tricked into paying $25 million to fraudsters using deepfake technology to impersonate the company's CFO. Authorities warn of scams targeting individuals through online shopping habits and impersonating loved ones, especially around Chinese New Year. Several new Python libraries have been released, including Uniflow, Letmodoit, Andes, and FLWR Nightly. Google has integrated a new AI feature into Google Maps that uses generative AI to help users discover new places. The Fed chair has spoken about the impact of AI on the economy and the need for new regulations to prevent failures like Silicon Valley Bank. Several new AI-related research papers have been published, covering topics such as text-to-speech, visual stimuli processing, and population-receptive fields. There are concerns that AI-powered sports betting is leading to a surge in problem gambling. Apple, Amazon, Meta, and AMD have all released their quarterly earnings results. LoopMe research suggests that UK consumers are not willing to pay to remove ads from Amazon Prime Video. Amnesty International has published a guide to defending the rights of refugees and migrants in the digital age. Google has integrated Gemini into BARD, which is expected to revolutionize the Google Assistant experience. It's unclear whether the Tesla Model Y or Toyota Corolla was the best-selling vehicle of 2023. Toyota is outselling Tesla overall, thanks in part to its success with hybrid vehicles. Intel is reportedly pushing to make the chip for the next-gen Xbox console. A new study sheds light on how the prefrontal cortex learns and stores value memories. Several new AI-related research papers have been published, covering topics such as text-to-speech, visual stimuli processing, and population-receptive fields. There are concerns that AI-powered sports betting is leading to a surge in problem gambling. Several new Python libraries have been released, including Sovitz SVC Fork, BNPM, PYEDCR, and AutoEvils. OpenAI has improved its method of aligning large language models with human preferences. Some Home Assistant users are experiencing an error when setting up Google Nest integration. A committee is concerned that young people will leave Sydney en masse due to housing affordability issues. The use of ChatGPT in creative writing is being debated among authors and writers. Nearly 70% of IT teams have integrated AI with their data protection protocols. AI can solve problems in schools but also poses potential threats, according to a Swedish researcher. An entrepreneur has curated a list of over 150 AI support chatbots for founders and startups. Jerome Powell says the Federal Reserve is researching the impact of AI on the U.S. economy. Some MacRumors forum users are wondering when Dolby Atmos slash spatial audio will be available on Apple Watch. Meta is planning to spend big on data centers and AI infrastructure in 2024. Amazon is selling $30,000 tiny homes that can be assembled easily. TikTok videos showcasing these homes have gone viral, with over 30.5 million views. ChatGPT, a machine learning model based on GPT 3.5 architecture, is rising rapidly and has benefits for automating industries, however, experts call for strict regulations to prevent misuse. RA Gataweel is a new machine learning library that simplifies the integration of state-of-the-art retrieval model Colbert.it makes Colbert more accessible with just a few lines of code. A Romanian startup has developed AI glasses that promise new levels of independence for blind people. Solvacy, a digital marketing startup, has launched an AI-powered social media management platform that IT aims to transform the digital marketing landscape. Google has announced a new AI feature for its chat product that can access your entire chat history for learning purposes, this raises privacy concerns.
U.S. police departments are using AI software to analyze millions of hours of unreviewed body cam footage, the goal is to identify problematic officers and patterns of behavior. Guidance on how to access and utilize Microsoft Fabric is available from P3 Adaptive. Meta has completed the second phase build-out of its AI Supercomputer Research Supercluster, RSC. Databricks has acquired Einblick, a startup founded by MIT and Brown University researchers, to boost its AI capabilities. Google's advertising revenue amounted to $305.63 billion US dollars in 2023. Researchers have developed ZK Matrix, a batched short proof for committed matrix multiplication. Researchers have developed zero-knowledge proofs of training for deep neural networks. China is investing in open-source chips to reduce reliance on U.S. technology. China-designed PC motherboards are emerging amid a push for technological independence. The semiconductor industry's revenue dipped in 2023 but NVIDIA surged amid AI demand. A new version of Tulu, a suite of Llama models, has been released on Hugging Face. Lifeboat News has published a guide on using Apple Vision Pro's Optic ID authentication. Tesla Roadster 12V battery replacement instructions have been shared on Tesla Motors Club. Mark Zuckerberg has been spotted with a new hairstyle, which some believe could be a mullet. SK Telecom Q4 net profit down due to base effect, SK Telecom's Q4 net profit decreased 16.2% from the previous year due to a base effect, but yearly earnings were solid due to growth in its AI business. Tesla driver crashes into wall, claims it was too dark to see, a Tesla Model 3 crashed into a brick wall in Serdang, Selangor. The driver claims it was too dark to see, but some speculate that autopilot mode may have been engaged. SK Hynix plans HBM4 launch by 2026, SK Hynix announced that it plans to launch its next-generation HBM4 memory in 2026, aimed at AI GPUs. Jack Antonoff comments on TikTok music dispute, music producer Jack Antonoff has spoken out about the ongoing dispute between TikTok and Universal Music Group stating that artists shouldn't get used to being paid less. TeamViewer launches real-time assistance app for Apple Vision Pro, TeamViewer has released a new app called Spatial Support, designed to provide real-time assistance for users of Apple Vision Pro. Innovations in pharma packaging to address industry demands, experts highlight the role of automation, A, and blockchain in addressing the challenges of the pharmaceutical packaging industry. Marketing expert calls faking death a new low. Marketing expert has criticized the recent trend of influencers faking their own deaths for publicity, calling it a new low in the industry. AI skill essential for success in 2024. New report highlights the importance of AI skills for professionals in 2024, suggesting that those who lack these skills will fall behind financially and professionally. iQuant combines AI and neuroscience for visual UX design, iQuant's technology merges AI and neuroscience to optimize visual user experience design. Google may rename Bard AI Chatbot to Gemini, Google is reportedly planning to rebrand its generative AI chatbot Bard to Gemini and launch an advanced version powered by Gemini Ultra. Microsoft releases security update for Edge browser. Microsoft has released a security update for its Edge browser to address a critical vulnerability. Samsung announces new DDR5 memory chips. Samsung has announced new, super-fast DDR5 memory chips that are expected to significantly improve performance. Number of Indian students in Canada expected to drop. The number of Indian students choosing to study in Canada is expected to decrease, while the United States remains the top destination for Indian students. MasterCard adopts generative AI for fraud detection. MasterCard is using generative AI to analyze over 1 trillion data points and predict the authenticity of transactions, strengthening fraud detection. Singtel collaborates with Google on RCS in Singapore. Singtel is the first in Singapore to offer rich communication services, RCS, with rich business messaging to its business customers, in collaboration with Google. Appen appoints new CEO, Appen has appointed Ryan Colon as its new CEO and managing director.
Colon has extensive experience in the AI industry and previously served as Appen COO. Amazon's plans for prime video profitability, Amazon CFO has highlighted the importance of advertising on prime video as a key strategy for making the service profitable. Report alleges Elon Musk's drug use with Tesla and SpaceX board members, a report claims that Elon Musk has used illegal drugs with some members of the Tesla and SpaceX boards. EU approves AI Act, this landmark decision sets the stage for comprehensive regulation of AI technologies within the European Union. Meta CEO Mark Zuckerberg is now richer than Microsoft founder Bill Gates, this is due to a recent $700 million dividend payout to Zuckerberg. New network on chip, NOC, configuration tool launched, this tool, from startup Signature IP, aims to reduce costs and speed up time to market for complex SOC designs. U.S. lawmakers consider tighter social media regulation, this comes amid concerns about the potential harms of social media, particularly for children. Intel releases new driver for HID PCI Mini Driver for ISS, this update addresses various issues and adds new functions. AI is increasingly being used in the workplace, this includes applications such as sensors and ML algorithms to make the most efficient use of electricity, and AI to reduce food waste. Computational characterization of the role of attention schema in controlling visuospatial attention. VC veterans report that AI is now a part of 80% of funding pitches. Google Circle to Search feature could arrive on other Android devices by October. Microsoft considers releasing the new Indiana Jones game on PS5 or Switch. New AI-powered search engine perplexity challenges Google, it claims to provide better results and avoid spam. Apple Vision Pro now available, a new mixed-reality headset that uses eye-tracking and pinch gestures for interaction. EU approves AI Act sets global precedent for regulating AI development and use. Feature space Bayesian adversarial learning improves malware detector robustness. Mobile PTX uses sparse coding for pneumothorax detection with limited training data. Graph reasoning network for multi-turn response selection via customized pre-training. Study identifies distinct neural features between initial and corrective phases of precise reaching. AI chip companies like LAM Research and LRCX are expected to see significant growth. AI startups are revitalizing San Francisco's commercial real estate market. ServiceNow is a potential undervalued AI stock in the workplace automation sector. Atcor, despite benefiting from 2021 inflation, might not be a good long-term investment. Google's AI chatbot Bard may be renamed Gemini. Researchers are working on guaranteeing the safety of autonomous vehicles. A deepfake scam tricked a Hong Kong clerk into transferring $200 million. Sega's AI computer from the 1980s resurfaces. AI5 could be the new group of leading tech stocks, replacing Fang and the Magnificent Seven. Mobile agent technology aims to provide a more natural user experience with AI. Big tech companies are emphasizing AI in their latest earnings reports. OnePlus integrates new AI features in its latest ColorOS update. VCs face challenges in assessing and attracting winning AI startups in a crowded market. AI is quietly changing everyday life, influencing areas like hiring, healthcare, and music. AI has the potential to improve cancer diagnosis and efficiency in crop pollination. Concerns exist about AI misuse like deepfakes in finance and literature. Researchers developed a new approach to identifying heart drugs using machine learning. An AI-generated song was released as the Last Beatles song. Emotionally expressive AI robots enhanced human collaboration in a study. Scientists used AI to reveal the ancient origin story of floral colors. A hexagonal copper disk lattice could lead to more efficient AI and communication devices. Debate on the ethical use of AI in writing and literature. Neuralink brain-computer interface technology is still under development. AI's role in the workplace is changing, potentially impacting both workers and managers. 
AI chip companies are expected to see significant growth in the coming years. A leaked change log circulating on social media suggests Google is preparing a major revamp of its Bard chatbot under the new name Gemini, alongside the launch of its highly anticipated Gemini Ultra model. Hugging Face just launched a free tool for easily building customizable AI assistants powered by open source models, positioning it as an alternative to OpenAI's GPT store offerings. Meshi has recently unveiled its new text-to-3D tool, Meshi 2. It enables users to create high-quality 3D models quickly. An AI model learned to recognize words like crib and ball by training on first-person video and audio captures from a baby's life, offering insights into human language development in a new study from researchers at New York University. A new study revealed that AI agents, including advanced LLMs like GPT-4, can potentially escalate military and diplomatic tensions in simulated war games. A mysterious deluxe chat model is making waves on IMSIS Arena, with impressive performance expected to be in line with top available models. Kleiner Perkins VCs Mamun Hamid and Ilya Fushman estimated that more than 80% of pitches they hear now involve AI in an interview with TechCrunch. Apple CEO Tim Cook hinted at a significant AI announcement coming from the company later this year during an analyst call following earnings reports. Google released Mobile Diffusion, a new approach that allows for near-instantaneous text-to-image generation on mobile devices. Alibaba's Quen VL Plus is quietly gaining ground on the top multimodal LLMs, with its vision capabilities reportedly matching or exceeding GPT-4. AI lobbying has reportedly surged over the last year, skyrocketing by 185% in 2023 with over 450 organizations engaging in response to increasing calls for AI regulation. Korean AI chip startup aims to rival Nvidia with Samsung chips. Google Bard can summarize YouTube videos and answer questions. Apple provides more details on Optic ID Iris authentication. Researchers identify drug to treat scarring after heart attacks. Facebook criticized for its impact on children despite 20th anniversary. Google is rebranding its AI chatbot Bard to Gemini, with free and paid versions planned. Japan allocates funds to support development of large language models in Japanese. Peugeot to integrate ChatGPT voice assistant in cars and vans. Google Maps location sharing helps track stolen phone in India. Facebook celebrates 20th anniversary, with mixed opinions on its impact. Safer Internet Day highlights need for online safety, especially for youth. Lightweight materials research using AI and machine learning underway. QX Lab launches multilingual AI platform Ask QX. Microsoft profits surge 33% driven by AI and deep learning technologies. Meta record strong Q4 and full-year 2023 earnings, with ad revenue rising. UK Arts Union concerned about impact of AI on artists' employment. Intel rumored to be developing a 24-core Aero Lake S CPU. Apple Vision Pro headset raises safety concerns, especially for children. Indian AI company leverages technology for road safety solutions. Deepfake technology used in financial scam, costing victim $25 million. AI's potential to enhance cancer treatment and replace clinical trials explored. Facebook celebrates 20th anniversary, with mixed opinions on its impact. Restaurants and retailers in Australia optimistic about future, plan expansion. Deepfakes used in political robocalls to impersonate President Biden. Chinese sellers bypass RTX 4090 GPU ban by buying pre-built PCs. Open-source AI models raise questions about monetization strategies. Generative AI adoption by media buying agencies for various applications. Google Chrome phasing out third-party cookies, marketers apathetic. Cybersecurity startups gain traction due to geopolitical tensions. Upcoming conferences on AI, health informatics, and aerosol science. AI adoption in logistics and supply chain increasing for better decision-making, cost reduction, and visibility. 
Trust in AI models is crucial for user adoption and integration. AI tools help improve order fulfillment with warehouse orchestration and inventory management. Human relationships with suppliers remain important despite AI advancements. Tesla settles for $1.5 million over improper waste management in California. AI applications in cancer nursing and insomnia evaluation being explored. Big tech companies boost profits by changing server life estimates. Debate on Elon Musk's threat to move Tesla legal home out of Delaware. Facebook celebrates 20th anniversary, with mixed opinions on Mark Zuckerberg's legacy. New research urges brands to embrace customer experience and adapt to their expectations. Tech-driven insights have elevated customer expectations, giving them more control over how brands market to them. Paper examines the impact of learning about AI harms on optimal adoption rate. New research explores copyright policy options for generative AI models. Kyrgyzstan develops AI solution that speaks and understands Kyrgyz language. Deepfake scammers impersonate CFO in video call, tricking company into sending $25 million. Microsoft and Foundation collaborate to boost digital skills in Nigerian civil service. 80% of enterprises predicted to adopt generative AI by 2026. Tesla worker arrested for threatening to kill Elon Musk and Biden. Facebook app update focuses on discovering creators and communities. Deep learning video explains the difference between machine learning and deep learning. Public investment bank maintains overweight rating on tech sector due to positive outlook. Microsoft expected to report strong revenue growth driven by AI adoption. Big brands like Apple remain optimistic on China despite some concerns. AI-driven demand forecasting helps reduce food spoilage in grocery industry. Circle to Search may become available on other Android devices later this year. New Android System Intelligence Update improves text selection. Samsung considers using MediaTek chips but Qualcomm remains dominant. ProMedicus launches medical imaging software for Apple's VR headset. AI streamlines customer service experience, Salesforce Einstein. eLabNext and ProMega partner to accelerate life science lab digitization. Generative AI, integrated care, and virtual wards are seen as the future of urgent care. Microsoft partners with Almoral to apply AI in dermatology drug discovery. Studies explore using deep learning for image recognition in language education and mental health analysis. ChatGPT productivity tips and methods to create your own chatbot are shared. Shark Tank India judges test drive India's first AI car, but question its practicality. Amazon is selling its stake in AI firm Anthropic amid bankruptcy proceedings. AI and satellite data reveal the true scale of untracked fishing and ocean industry activity. Researchers discover exposed API secrets impacting major tech tokens, highlighting widespread security challenges. Microsoft uses generative AI to predict equilibrium distribution in molecular systems. K-pop group TWIC releases a remix of their single featuring AI-powered chatbot Lauv. New Python libraries released, Wordtum, Text Analysis, Superb AI Label, AI Labeling, Cloudflare AI, Cloudflare AI API Wrapper. Tesla raised the price of the Model 3 long range in the US by $1,000. Google Bard AI Image Generator can be accessed using a VPN in restricted regions. Microsoft users seek solutions for managing email accounts and app requirements. Deepfake scammer tricks finance worker into sending $25 million. Google releases sound amplifier app for improved accessibility. OnePlus adds AI features similar to Galaxy S24 and Pixel phones. Generative AI's impact and implications in the legal field are explored. AI is used for safer ship navigation and optimizing aquaculture. AI helps in cybersecurity by enabling mitigation, identifying patterns, and offering advice. CoinRule is an AI-based platform for automating cryptocurrency trading strategies. 
Samsung One UI Launcher and Wear OS apps are now available for compatible non-Samsung devices. AI is being used to unlock the secrets of the atmosphere and ocean. AFL, India, sees profits increase due to growth in CPCU business. January's tech stock decline impacted unprofitable AI companies like Nuance. Diesel Legacy, an upcoming co-op fighting game, supports local and online co-op, sentencing hearing begins for Samsung Chief in 2015 merger case. Samsung One UI Launcher and Wear OS apps are ported to non-Samsung devices, debate on legal ramifications of AI-generated art. Laney Wilson criticizes AI misuse in music industry. 86% of hedge funds give staff access to generative AI tools. AI seen as transforming supply chain and logistics. Orin AI chip startup aims to rival NVIDIA with Samsung chips. Bell and Mila partner on deep learning AI for telecom. Apple, OnePlus, and Burlasoft launch new generative AI features or platforms. Experts warn of potential job losses in entertainment due to generative AI. Google Cloud unveils new generative AI tools for retailers. Kleiner Perkins VC firm sees a surge in AI investment pitches. British firm Chromex secures funding for AI-powered radiation detection. China literature seen as a buy due to AI investment and content pipeline. Samsung Galaxy S24 Ultra Review highlights its AI features. AI used in food processing, medical imaging, and cardiovascular risk assessment. Donald Trump criticizes AI as dangerous. OpenAI forms a team to address AI governance issues. Companies lobbied heavily to limit AI regulations in 2023. AI tools help assess and attract AI startups for investment. UK and EU employers face data privacy changes in 2024. Study reveals gender gap in teachers' ethical AI choices. Samsung uses Baidu AI in China's S24 series, causing user backlash. AI chip shortage impacting Huawei smartphone production. AI used in marketing, education, healthcare, and cybersecurity. Generative AI's risks and benefits being explored. Revenue rebounds despite China, AI, and Vision Pro challenges. Generative AI used in marketing but raises ethical concerns. Doctors using AI to summarize medical notes face risks. AI-generated model used in Japanese ad worries artists. Konami testing non-art-related AI in Yu-Gi-Oh! Game.AI-powered tool makes fake IDs An underground website claims to use AI to create realistic fake IDs for cheap, raising security concerns. Text summarization in SAS Studio, a guide showcases how to use NLP techniques in SAS Studio to summarize text documents efficiently. Investing in digitalization for manufacturers, businesses in the manufacturing industry need to invest in digital tools and data-driven strategies to stay competitive. High demand for NVIDIA RTX 4090 in China Despite a ban, the RTX 4090 graphics card is popular in China's black market due to limited availability of the official alternative. AI Dungeon offers interactive text adventures A new AI tool creates personalized, text-based adventures based on user input. Upcoming Indian movie releases This week sees the release of several Indian movies including Lal Salam and Terry Bhattan Main. AI is poised to transform a majority of jobs in developed economies. Businesses are increasingly using AI for tasks like data integration, process automation, and cybersecurity. Open-source AI models are becoming more popular for enterprise use. Researchers are developing AI systems that can learn from multiple modalities, like sight and sound. AI is being used to study human health and bioengineering. The Weather Channel launched a new iPhone app with AI and AR features. Checkpoint Software achieved high marks in a cybersecurity benchmark report. New tool, Arc Search, combines browser, chatbot, and search functionalities. Roblox rolls out real-time AI translation for in-game chat. 
AI-powered recipe generator uses avocados to create new recipe ideas. Tool allows asking in-depth questions about information within a textbook PDF. Design trends in the nail art industry for 2024, including AI-powered designs. SingularityNet relocates to Switzerland to be closer to Web3 partners and support innovation. Cadence launches AI-powered platform for analyzing complex fluid dynamic simulations. West Coast digital marketing expert to speak at SEO conference about AI's impact on search engine optimization. Financial news, interactive brokers reports increase in options contracts and daily average revenue trades. Analyst predicts strong top-line growth for Pinterest in Q4 earnings report. New open-source Python library, TAPI, simplifies data science application development. Max Planck Institute and Google expand their AI research partnership. Cybersecurity remains the top global business risk in 2024. Deepfakes used in $25.6 million scam, highlighting phishing dangers. New machine learning tool identifies drugs for heart disease treatment. ByteDance CEO warns employees about complacency in the face of AI disruption. Three stocks predicted to benefit from the generative AI boom in 2024. Caterpillar can benefit from AI in equipment usability and labor pool expansion. AI red teams test internet vulnerabilities to improve online safety. ABB acquires 7 cents, specializing in AI-enabled mobile robots. Google Pixel 8 might get Galaxy S24's generative edit AI photo editing feature. Research on AI-powered self-referral system for mental health treatment. Beijing unveils AI child robot, Tong Tong, with childlike behavior. Qualcomm introduces AI-upgraded Snapdragon X Elite processor. Report finds consumers want disclosure of AI use by companies. New open-source Python library, TAPI, for data science applications. Langchain Framework helps integrate large language models, LLMs, into Python applications. Cybersecurity is crucial for AI applications due to their increasing integration in various sectors. Adaptive learning software market expected to grow due to demand for personalized learning. Energy Hire Platform uses AI for job description generation and candidate search. Oracle expands U.S. cloud market presence through partnerships, offering more choices for enterprises. Press Ganey unveils new AI-powered products for healthcare, focusing on improving human experience. Deepfake images of Taylor Swift originated from an online challenge to bypass filters. MediaTek's new chipsets boast improved performance and generative AI support. AI helps scholars decipher a scroll buried during Vesuvius eruption in 79 AD. Meta Oversight Board criticizes the company's manipulated media policy, calling for a broader focus on potential harm. 2,000-year-old mystery solved using AI, and GPU reseller prediction comes true. Goth, an AI homework helper app, expands its capabilities beyond math. ABB acquires 7 cents, a company specializing in AI-enabled mobile robotics. Book recommendation, AI infects ship captain, turning her into an insect-like creature. DAWNet allows self-hosting Python code and AI models in music software. Report on the state of AI in the cloud for 2024. New York City explores AI to improve emergency response times. Report predicts advancements in AI, imaging agents and ultrasound tech for diagnostics in 2024. Donald Trump expresses concerns about AI and central bank digital currencies. Review of deep learning for smart building energy forecasting. Paper proposes a multimodal sentiment analysis technique using AI. Yandex sells Russian assets, focusing on AI subsidiaries operating outside the country. Generative AI image of a lost city in the year 3099. BIM software automatically converts drawings into 3D models using AI. Device design needs improvement for sustainability and reusability. Checkpoints Firewall excels in advanced threat prevention. 
MasterCard uses AI for customer experience and fraud prevention. Debate continues on the best career path, cybersecurity versus data science. TikTok faces music licensing issues and accusations of strong-arming musicians. Clemson creates a center to study human-AI interaction. Scientists use AI to investigate galaxy structure and behavior. Deepfake scam tricks finance worker into transferring $25 million. AI helps identify trends for successful Etsy shops in 2024. Atlassian leverages AI for cloud migration, enterprise focus, and IT service management. Jua raises $16 million to build an AI model for weather forecasting and natural world applications. Siemens integrates generative AI into their predictive maintenance solution. Google Maps uses generative AI for personalized place discovery. Debate continues on the role of prompt engineers in AI development. Health systems create new C-suite roles for tech leadership. WatchMojo uses AI art for thumbnails, sparking mixed reactions. Melody wins Singapore Startup of the Year for improving access to scientific papers. Open banking trends for 2024 highlight continued AI adoption. Bing Image Creator offers a simple AI-powered image generation tool. Deepfake scam tricks financial worker into transferring $26 million. Google Maps adds generative AI-powered discovery feature for personalized experience. NVIDIA highlights new laptops with powerful GPUs at CES 2024. AI helps diagnose cervical cancer by pinpointing cells for review. AI personalizes and automates underwriting in embedded insurance. Debate continues on the acceptability of AI-generated content. Generative AI gains popularity, but predictive AI remains crucial. Meta urged to update deepfake policies after manipulated Biden video. The potential of AI in geospatial technology and academic research is explored. RealHub365 offers an all-in-one real estate CRM with AI features. RealReport secures funding to expand their AI-powered home buying transparency tool. OnePlus integrates AI features similar to Samsung and Google flagships. Freshfields hires a global chief innovation officer with experience in AI. Indonesia uses developed nations as models for its AI ecosystem. EU approves the world's first comprehensive AI regulation. Safer Internet Day resources focus on emerging technologies like AI. Google introduces AI app Gemini, facing competition from ChatGPT. Hologic receives FDA clearance for AI-powered cancer diagnostic system. Debate continues about job cuts at big tech companies despite profits. Avia's AI platform is a leader in intelligent contact centers. MindBreeze and Ariza partner to improve content management with AI. Huge launches AI-powered culture decoder for marketing strategies. Marketers' biggest AI concern is privacy, not human factors. Super Bowl ad showcases Google AI that helps the blind take photos. Meta profits surge, company gives back with first dividend. ChatGPT reportedly overcame recent sluggishness with a software update. Limbic AI's AI helps increase mental health access for minority groups. AI chatbots in war games tend to choose violence and nuclear strikes. Researchers develop a method for proving training correctness of deep neural networks. Konami announces Yu-Gi-Oh! Early Days Collection Game for the West, a Dual Links VR experience, and a Master Dual XAI project. OpenAI plans to make AI more democratic by involving the public in decision-making about its powerful systems. Hugging Face offers a streamlined process for translating text using pre-trained AI models. Google AI's flood forecasting system helps communities prepare for natural disasters. An underground website uses AI to generate fake IDs, raising cybersecurity concerns. Study finds Samsung's latest smartphones are vulnerable to human error despite advanced AI features. Ultrasight partners with Selvis Healthcare to develop AI-powered cardiac ultrasound software. 
Facebook's manipulated media policy criticized for being incoherent and potentially enabling election misinformation. LinkedIn integrates online learning into its platform to upskill users. Call for proposals for the Brass Online Symposium on Social Justice, Critical Librarianship, and AI. Design Trends 2024 Furniture Industry Report highlights consumer desire for connection, quiet luxury, and blurred lines between work life spaces. Sustainability and wellness are key considerations. Human AI Interaction Clemson University to open a $1.4 million center studying human AI interaction, focusing on a rapidly growing industry. Supply chain management Companies like Stitch Fix, Macy's, and Kraft Heinz use AI for supply chain monitoring and optimization. AI in healthcare research explores how AI assistants can aid doctors in dermatology, potentially addressing bias in diagnoses based on skin tone. Open Text updates security auditing tool to help developers address complex threats. Microsoft partners with Semaphore to apply AI responsibly in news content creation. Risks and considerations of shadow AI projects within companies. White House provides update on AI executive order implementation. Teacher uses pen and paper to combat AI cheating in the classroom. Microsoft AI solutions used in education to enhance learning and efficiency. Reimagine Education Digital event on March 6 focuses on AI in education. Turkish mobility app Marty acquires Zoba for AI powered fleet optimization. Investor enthusiasm in China's AI startups wanes despite global interest. Report Consumers expect high standards from retailers despite economic pressures. TCS uses AI and ML to transform Europe Assistance's IT operating model. AI trading platforms help beginners optimize crypto trading profits. New legal tech project aims to increase access to justice for middle class. Microsoft ClipChamp adds audio recording and text-to-speech improvements. Leo Lab selected for U.S. space program using AI for space domain awareness. Automatic speech translation solutions showcased at Eurosatory 2026. Instagram to add automatic in-app text translation in July. Recap of the Winter 2023 Machine Learning AI and Data Science Conference. Ericsson and IIT Kudgapur partner on AI and edge computing research for 6G. Researchers use AI to read ancient papyri, potentially rewriting history. New method combines AI and satellite imagery to map crop livestock systems. Samsung argues there is no such thing as a real picture due to generative AI. Roblox releases real-time AI chat translator for 16 languages. AI agent Pokelman can beat humans at Pokemon. Surge in digital apprenticeships across UK fueled by AI interest. AI assisting journalists in various tasks, but specific details unclear. AI applications in music industry being explored cautiously. Strategies for overcoming data maturity challenges for AI adoption. Machine learning identifies key factors for prediabetes prediction. NASA uses AI to analyze satellite data for sustainable farming. Deepfake AI used to trick employee into $25 million transfer. Amazon launches AI shopping assistant and outlines broader AI ambitions. Samsung and Baidu partner on AI for Galaxy S24, but impact on sales unclear. Dino 2023 update highlights progress toward simplified web development. Quebec's MMTS event focuses on AI for cost-efficient manufacturing. AI-powered chatbot aims to improve accessibility to mental health treatment. Learning resources, Google LLM system design interview tips and fixing errors in AI assistant code. Creative AI, runway AI film competition entries showcase cool short films. Facebook, Meta reaches 20 years, focuses on metaverse with AI integration. Teachers and AI, study explores factors influencing ethical AI use in classrooms. Meta Oversight Board allows edited Biden video, urges policy review.
10 AI Innovations Predicted to Change Life by 2027 AI-Powered I for Visually Impaired People in Development Machine Learning Used to Predict Organ Donor Selection and Diabetes Risk Legal AI Early Adopters Gain Advantage, with tools like Lexus Plus AI and Clause Builder emerging. Generative AI Use Cases in Legal Research, Drafting, and Arbitration Explored Alphabet misses search revenue estimates, but cloud unit shows strong growth. Meta Oversight Board upholds edited Biden video due to policy loophole, urging changes. Extended Internet of Things, XIoT, benefits and challenges explored. AI in elections raises concerns but mirrors familiar challenges. Multilingual translation model breaks down language barriers in Roblox. Importance of family conversations about generative AI safety highlighted. Atlassian Intelligence uses AI for easier issue search in JIRA. TEDx Talks explore artistic innovations and ethical considerations in AI. Speech recognition, new research proposes using an external model to improve accuracy in speech recognition systems, up to 14.3% improvement. National AI Research Infrastructure U.S. Task Force outlines plans for broader access to resources for AI research and development. AI Startup Wins Award AI Nexus Healthcare's MIA Platform Wins Startup Innovation Award at Davos. AI-generated video, Google's Lumiere model explored for its potential in video generation. Building a chatbot with Google Cloud Run and Dialogflow. Using AI for drug discovery and the need for guardrails. Importance of Cybersecurity in Enterprise Communications AI helps scholars read ancient Greek scroll buried by Vesuvius eruption. Mid-Journey Profitable Adult Coloring Book Niches for Etsy K-Pop Criticism of Zero Basion for Using AI Voice Resembling Idols NVIDIA Stock Rises The stock hit a record high due to anticipation of gains from AI. Canada and AI, Canada partners with NVIDIA for AI and a pioneer urges regulations. AI tools and advancements, ChatGPT, Intelligentia AI, and LinkSquares are mentioned. Google Bard AI chatbot is being renamed to Gemini Worldwide. Key players include Anthropic Claude, Bard, ChatGPT, OpenAI, Stable Diffusion, Midjourney, Dolly, Hugging Face. Google reportedly rebranding Bard to Gemini with a subscription tier. Data annotation services crucial for training AI models. NVIDIA A-Series GPUs used for 3D printing applications. Samsung to bring AI features to older Galaxy phones. Debate on AMD slash NVIDIA adding modding features to their AI tools. AI to contribute 61 billion euros to Portugal's economy by 2030 study finds. Japan commits over $56 million for generative AI development to rival US's ChatGPT. China and Russia to collaborate on strategic use of AI in military. Apple CEO Tim Cook tells analysts on earnings calls that the company is working on AI initiatives that the company is incredibly excited about and expects announcements later this year. Scale AI, the multi-billion dollar AI startup, scrapped a deal with Chinese-owned TikTok over security concerns, according to a Forbes report. Russian tech company Yandex has agreed to a $5 billion-plus sale that will see the company come under full Russian ownership. Open-source AI platform Hugging Face announces customizable Hugging Chat Assistance, an open-source alternative to ChatGPT's custom GPTS. Yikes! Hong Kong police say worker at a company was tricked into paying $25 million to fraudsters who posed as the company's chief financial officer using deepfake technology. UK Arts Union ready to strike if AI agreements aren't reached. Google's Bard AI chatbot will soon be called Gemini. Foxconn sees slightly better 2024 warns on AI chip shortage. OnePlus adds AI features to its flagship phones but only in China. All 27 ambassadors of EU member states have passed the final draft of the EU's AI Act, a plan for regulating AI applications, 
making the EU the first to put regulations and guidance in place for the safe and ethical use of AI. Follow and subscribe to AI Trends YouTube channel for latest AI industry updates and trends.